So, I've been seeing some criticisms that Peter B. Parker was emasculated in Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. They pointed to his pink fuzzy bathrobe and the fact that he was excited to show off his daughter to everyone. Look, any day now, my first child is going to be born. And it's a girl. Which means I'm gonna be a girl dad. And I am so excited to be a girl dad. Granted, am I terrified by the fact that my wallet is always going to be empty from now on? Sure. But I will be sharing with everyone in my life how freaking adorable my daughter is. We can tell from the 3D ultrasounds she looks like her mom, so yeah, she's gonna be adorable. A father being excited about his child is not emasculating. In fact, I think it is far more masculine. We've talked about toxic masculinity for a long time, but I've actually argued that when masculinity becomes toxic, it is no longer masculine, but rather childish. If you have to constantly remind people that you're a man, then you're, you're a child, you're not a man. Action, speaking louder than words and all that. And being there for your child and loving your child is a healthy masculine trait. Men should want to take care of their family. And taking care of them is not just providing financially, but also emotionally and spiritually. Plus, it's like they didn't even pay attention to that conversation that Peter B. Parker had with Miles about how he was scared to become a father and Miles made him want to become a father. That May Day only exists because of how great of a person Miles is. And how Miles pushed him to stop being this fearful, scared, self-pitying person and actually take a risk and have a family. Because that's what not wanting to have kids in the first movie was. It was fear. And like a man, he overcame that fear and became a proud girl dad. So no, Peter B. Parker was not emasculated because he's a good father. Although some might argue taking your baby into, you know, interdimensional battles might not be a good thing to do. But other than that, he's, he's a pretty solid father. <laughs> I mean, ignoring your wife's wishes and endangering your children, that's that's pretty traditionally masculine. <laughs> but I joke. It's, it's a cartoon. Obviously, nothing bad's going to happen to May Day. She's there for comedic relief. Oh, and as for the pink bathrobe, think of it this way. Uh, that bathrobe fits him. Mary Jane is significantly smaller than him. It is not her robe. And I guarantee you that robe was white when he bought it. But then what happens to all Spider-Man? I'm telling you, it's a canon event. He washed white clothes with his suit and it turned pink. Messing up a load of white laundry is a canon event for Spider-Man. I'm telling you.